defense. So let's see if they can make an opening statement as they've given the Seawolves a first down on the penalty. This is Masonette picking his way up across the 13. Orange show blitz, here they come. Masonette caught behind the line and dropped. First, nice read by Reddish. He sees him coming out. Sproul gets him down low, gets away. Reddish finishes him off, and Sproul turned it in, and the D-back did what he's supposed to. Hit him hard, hit him hard. <laughs> Versus back at about their own 15-yard line. Full house backfield, Masonette through a big seam, and with Masonette behind Essington. And they give it to him, and he gets a little push from Essington. Masonette behind Essington. He'll get it again. First down inside. You know, they, they zone block to the right, then he just cuts off where he sees the hole open up. And their fourth possession of the first quarter. Masonette, left side. Not much. Got to put pressure on Essington. They come at him. Gets the ball complex. So that's going on right now. We've got a lot of positive things happening in the program. And, and uh, obviously with Jim Beheim still with the basketball program and all our other sports. Team 10. Masonette, right side. Slips one, but not the other. Essington. Crowd making some noise. Masonette, right side. Still going and a first down across. The I was going to say they got the defense there. Yeah, I was going to say they got to get some pressure on it, but he gets the ball off and they just looking for a pass and came up with a run. They do a nice job for the first time this afternoon. See how they respond. Masonette cuts it back upfield and got about and they're right on pace. Masonette again. To the ground again. Mason at first down. He hurdles the tackle and he's still going. Up the sidelines. Mason Nett will score. 72 yards on the, the Seawolves are back in front. You got a great job. They're blocking down. Lisi, 65, cut everything off. And then that leap and the athletic ability of Masonette puts wow. them right back in the lead. Watch. Nobody there to hold. There's the block right there. Lisi, then the jump. Jumped nobody right over Keon Lynn. Nobody wrapped him up. You got to get arms and shoulder on him. Second and 19. Asenette dancing up across the 15. He only got about three. Not in the game. Running play. Asenette. Tries to cut it upfield. Mason Adds caught behind the line and third and long. Take a look at the transfer. This is the play. They got to stop it. Make a punt. Get out and score. And then we can then we can have a beer. Be a play action. They hand it to Masonette, and That's he's it. not going to get, get there. That's it. You didn't pay me a penny. <laughs> Either one of you. Coach, what are you seeing out of the Syracuse team this season? Uh, they I played think, tonight. I think Syracuse is back. Now they got us just got a winning feeling and know that's where they belong, see? That's the idea. Uh, Masonette, yards after contact. He dragged. Right side. side. Behind Vamiro. Close to a first down with a play. Whoever's running that outfit up there, you got to give him credit because Central New York is football this time of the year. Basketball. Masonette bounces outside. Stiff arm. Close to another option other than going on the cell service. It's just a great, great technology. The university stepped up and helped us out with that. And at the concession stands now. Uh, not. Down by four. Holding penalty, moves it back to their own six. Sariki Diabate and Marquis. Let's go. Orange hit Masonette. Jay Brock. Orange 
Bulldogs get to Mason Eddy short. And I think they Stony Brook has two and a half. And a quick set to the line. Masonette has the first down and more. A flag comes down, though. It's you know, it's, it's, it's something that happens. I think you're not going to see it here. You're going to see him break to the outside. There, oh, there you, you there might see is. it right there. Yeah. Yep. He hooked. Dyshawn Davis looked like. And you know what?